JD, tell me about, uh, first off, you guys, you come here to the Ohio RTC every day. It's at Ohio State's room. This is where you wrestled for all five years of college. Yep. And uh, does this just feel like home to you when you come here? And does it feel like you kind of ever left Oak Harbor High School almost? Uh, in a way, you know, I mean, it's, it's so many things in wrestling turn into just the, another thing. I mean, now I don't even, my, my blood pressure and heart rate stays the same when I go to Poland or when I go to Colorado or when I go to Oak Harbor. It doesn't matter. It's just like, it's just traveling as part of it. So, um, but yeah, don't come here. I, this is 10 years. This is year number 10. 10 years here year, in this room? This is year number 10. So fall of 2003 is when I came here after my, I graduated from Oak Harbor and, and uh, been here with Russ Helks and Mitch Clark, Kenny Ramsey and uh, Tommy Rollins. And, and then now with a new staff and- Coach Ryan Roselli. Yep, it was Haskell. Jaggers is your Haskett teammate. Yeah. Jaggers is your teammate. Uh -huh. wow. Jaggers is my teammate for, I think, three years. You, you guys wrestled together for three years? I believe so. Wow. Yeah. Well, he's a 2004 graduate of high school or 2005? I, uh, I think four. I'm not four? sure. And you're three? Yeah. So, so yeah. You guys were together for a while, huh? Yeah. But uh, when you guys are in here, it feels like home. Do you do a lot of that stuff with the med balls? Yeah, I mean, we'll have conditioning and sometimes we'll do certain throws over our shoulder or squats with them they're they're really they're really nice and they go up to i think i think our heaviest one's 120 um but sprinting with those is pretty hard in front of you and then lunges we'll do lunges with those too sometimes in our, and obviously when you're doing it holding it in front of you it's a lot better for your your core and uh your back and your stabilization muscles kettlebells i don't see any kettlebells there are some oh there are some they're there there are some haven't haven't cleaned this place up in a few days. Looks like, but it's not my job. Do they do they have your picture over here on the side at all? Yeah, that picture like old old freshman year picture, right there on the bottom left. They're trying to they're looking. Is that to, you? They're looking to update all. Holy this. smokes, dude! Who? Is, whoa! Look at your fro. And yeah, that's when you that was when you lost first round. Hey, that just happened last year, again. Do you know that? No. Donnie, Donnie Vinson lost first round and came back. Oh, oh, oh. The last first, year, not, yeah, this, not this past year. 2012. Yeah, yeah. He beat Cam, sorry for third Yeah, fourth. they both did the same thing. Yeah, they both did the same thing. And then they, right. But you were the last so person. So Cam, Cam did. You were the last person before that so, to happen. So, no, no, the, the Cornell kid, right? Before, or was that before me? No, the war there was before a there you was, was Lange, Lange of Penn There was State. a Cornell kid that did it after me then. Yeah? Yeah, Minotti, Dustin Minotti, I think. Did but, uh, Anyway, uh, Tassari did what I did my junior year, and I and then Vincent did what I did my freshman year. If I would wow. if I would have won my th junior year, I'd have been the only guy to do it twice. There you go. But there you, you go. You know who I lost to? You lost to Chris Weidman. Chris Weidman, Chris Weidman. For, Weidman. For, for third, yeah. The guy who just knocked the spider out. Yeah, which is awesome. I was so pumped, dude. I, I got I got goosebumps. I jumped up. I almost got lightheaded and fell over. Do you carry this around at all? Yeah, yeah. No one wants to wrestle the shoot. <laughs> no one wants to wrestle the shoot, man. Uh, yeah, it's crazy I'm not up on that wall over there to the right. Yeah, that's, well. That's just crazy, but neither is Reese. We kind of had similar careers. I didn't even realize that um, until that nice article that was written just came out. So, it's pretty cool. I think you're, you're all right. You're doing all right in life, though. Sure, man. Even though you're not on that wall. God is good all the time, no matter what.